Welcome to my channel. Hit that subscribe button so you get an alert every time I post new content, and I post new content every single week. For those of you that don't know me, my name's Angelique. I post things that are all about health and wellness and how you can look and feel your very best at any age. So let's be it. I just jumped out of the shower, getting ready to start my day. And the first thing I'm going to do is put on my morning glow serum right here. It's empty. Get every last bit out. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and apply that onto my skin. And don't forget to put it down your neck. Be sure to let your product dry five minutes in between. But if you're like me, you don't have time. So you're gonna grab yourself your little fan and you're gonna speed up the drying process just like this. You can get this on Amazon, CVS, TikTok shop, I'm sure, wherever. Just pick one up and it helps you get ready quicker. Next up, I have my moisturizer. And this is Timeless Beauty Cream. It's by Jazleek. And you can you look at the link in my bio for that if you're curious about that. But this is a makeup tutorial. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that on here. I'm just gonna share with you everything that I use on my skin. And don't forget your neck. Voila, back to the fan. If you don't have a fan, you can just let it sit in for five minutes if you've got that kind of time. But I don't have that kind of time. Also, next I move on to my eye cream, Youthful Eyes. You can go ahead and check that link in my bio. And I put that underneath my eyes. I also use it around my smile and up and above. Under your eyes is a very delicate area, so you wanna use a different type of moisturizer there, just like that. Okay, that's on. Back to the drying. And just like that, I finish up and I dry that, dry my And if you haven't hit that subscribe button, it's not too late. Go ahead, hit subscribe so you get those alerts every time I post new content. Okay, so that should be good. All right, let's begin. First off, we don't have time waste when we're getting ready. So I keep all my brushes right here, right in my medicine cabinet, and I keep my everyday makeup in a little container. I don't know, I think this is made by, yeah, by Ziploc. This way, it's all in one spot. If I have to travel, if I have to go anywhere, I just grab this and I'm ready to go. All my brushes are upright, staying nice and clean. They're not contaminating, they're not getting gross and icky. For me, I like to have a different brush for everything. So I'm gonna start with my concealer. This is L'Oreal Age Perfect. It's a tinted balm, it's cream based. For my age, this works best. So right here like this, I just go ahead and apply it right underneath. Oh, there's a little bit of cream right there. Right underneath my, oh, there's a little bit more. I didn't get it off. And that is the first one. So this is lightweight. It's not a heavy concealer. It's just a balm that I put right underneath. I also add this to anywhere that I want any highlights, just like that. I like a very natural look. Now I'm gonna go one step darker. And again, this is L'Oreal Age Perfect. And it is the tinted balm. It's just a little bit darker than my under eye concealer and I'm just going to very minimal amount to my skin here. I don't like a lot of coverage. Your skin is really your base, okay? So that is the foundation of your skin. So you just want to enhance your natural beauty. I'm just gently tapping that on, putting on a little bit of color. I'll add just a little bit more. I use three different bombs, okay? They are all by L'Oreal. All right, my next one is a shade darker. And I'm gonna use my brush, just add a little bit here, right here, to do my contouring. I don't spend a lot of money on my makeup. I don't find it necessary. I put my money into my skincare products, the way I take care of my skin, and all the different things I use. I'll make another video that shows you all of my skincare products that I use. Okay, so I started up here. I just made that little like letter three down my chin. Same thing over here and here. So now I'm ready to start applying a little bit more pressure to it. So I have my sponge here, my beauty blender, and I'm just gonna gently start tapping this into my skin. I'm not smearing it around. So I'm going up my eye as well to contour my eye and around my nose, anywhere that I added the highlight to, I'm going up, up and around my eye, right like that. Be sure to get that contour and you wanna go on your chin. As and this really is a great everyday look. It's nice and simple. There's not a lot of steps to it. There's not a lot of product, different types. It blends really nice, lightweight, all natural, an all natural look. Okay, so I think that's enough for today of that. And I'm gonna gently put this down. Now I'm gonna take my big fluffy brush and I'm just gonna blend it in a little bit, just settling it down. I don't use any powder on my face. Powder settles as we age in our lines and wrinkles. 
so I don't want any of that happening. So I'm just tapping it in, settling it, and I like a nice big fluffy brush, it's soft. and it feels nice on my skin. Okay, the next step is my blush, and I use Tarte, I love this. And the color I'm using is Juicy Blush, and that has its own brush as well. So it's angled, and I just tap a little bit on here, and I'm just going up, I start at the apples, and I go right like that. Just a little bit on each side. Nothing crazy, I just want a beautiful, natural, dewy look to my skin, and right like that. And I wanna even it out on both sides, and voila, that is done. I really enjoy this blush. It's really pretty, it goes on nice and easy. I like lightweight, I don't like to be weighed down for my everyday look. All right, right there. Next up, I have, um, this is by Tarte as well. This is called Fake Awake. So back in the 80s and the 90s, we used white eyeliner inside to like pop our eye, but now we've gotten smarter in 2024 and we start, you were using a peach color, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on one side of my eyes and you can really see the difference here. Okay, so I put that on here and if you see this eye and you look at this eye, this eye, on. Um, the right side of my face looks more awake and more vibrant. And that's the kind of look that I want. I want to look awake and vibrant. Listen, I'm 53, I have three children, I'm married, my parents, their dog, my two businesses. It's, I, I don't have time. I often, I'm gonna be honest, I don't get the proper sleep, so I look a little tired. So this really just helps give me that pop. Let me do the other side. Okay, so right like that, perfect. Next thing I have, again, for underneath my eyes because I, Need a little help there. It's Tarte, it's called Glow Tape. It's a highlighter. I love this. This is like new as well to my regimen. I think I've been using it for about two months. I just put a little bit underneath there going up because I want to lift the eye. And I will use the same brush that I used for my lighter foundation underneath there. And I'm just gently going up, bringing that highlight up. So it really gives it that glisten. And if you look at the shine on my face, the shine is unbelievable. It's very youthful. My skin looks very hydrated. That's from the products that I use. Now, that'll be a whole nother video, but this is so from the products that I use. I love it. I've been using these products for like six months now, maybe longer, maybe seven months, and it really has improved the quality, the texture, the hydration of my skin. I really love it, but um, I'll make another video for that. All right, so up and around, but you certainly can check out the link um, in my bio for that information if you wanna look at the product. All right, next up we have my eyebrows. So I don't know about you, but I'm too scared to get microblading done. So I use an eyeshadow and this is a nice, I think it also can be an eyelash, I'm not sure. And then another brush for that, I use an angled narrow brush there. And I use this color right here. This is Swiss Chocolate by MAC. In 2003, I got married and I went to a, a men, this is what they used. I haven't changed since, I'm a creature of habit. I like to use what works. If it works, hey, why, why try something different? So I really like that. So I, sometimes I do a little bit too much when I'm rushing in the morning, you know, but I've got a little bit more control of my hand. And you'll have to make sure that you get the other side. Just a little bit more here, and voila. Give it a little brush to shape it. So this is the difference. This side has a shadow in the eyebrow, and this side does not. Let's do the other side. Okay, just like that, that's done. Now let's brush the other side. All right, so that is the look so far. Nice and simple, all natural. And now we've got to curl up the eyelashes. So right like that, give a couple of little pumps there. Love the look of false eyelashes, but I, I don't have the time to sit there. Between getting your hair done, your nails done, your toes done, your eyelashes done, going for massages, ugh, who's got the time to do that as well? So I just do them myself. And right like that, they are both curled up. Okay, so one more time, I'm just gonna use my fluffy brush, blend that in, blend underneath, swooping up, around my mouth, down my neck, and maybe just a little bit more blush right there. Pop the cheeks just a tad. Smile when you put it on. And just like that, that part of it is done. Next up, we have the mascara. Okay, so 
Next up, we have Sexy Mother Pucker. That's the lipstick I use. It's really lip gloss. I don't wear lip uh, lipstick, I wear lip gloss. I also use Tarte, a very nude, natural. My everyday look is very natural. When I go out, I get glammed up, va va boom, but not for my everyday. All right, next up, I am doing my mascara. I use multiple mascaras. I actually use three different mascaras. The first one I put on is CoverGirl Lash Blast Clean. And I just give a quick pass right there on my eyelash, on the top, little bit on the bottom. I don't wear, I wear a lot on the bottom, but I like just a little bit to show. Next, I have the other side. And then from there, I will move on to a different one. So this is just my base. Okay, that's it. That's That one's done. Next, I move on to, oh, this is CoverGirl as well, Lash Blast Volume. Okay, give a couple of swirls. You never wanna go like that because that is putting air in there. So I just go right over, same way, right over what I first applied. Just a little bit on the bottom, just a bit. Other side, just like that, that one's done. Moving on to my last one, which is Maybelline. I think it's Colosso, I, I, I don't really know. So again, swirl it, take a little bit off the side. If you had a tissue, you could just tap the end of it to get it off. Go back in for another swirl, other side. Oops, my eyelid. Now I drop my mascara. All right, just like that, that's all done. Okay, so that is my makeup, my everyday look in less than 10 minutes using only a few products. I had one concealer, two concealers, three concealers, highlighter, blush, so five things, plus my eyebrows makes it six, plus my lip gloss makes it seven, and my mascara makes it eight. So 10 minutes or less, a beautiful all natural look in less than 10 minutes with only eight products. All right, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and you'll get alerted for each and every week when I put out new content. I hope that helps. Bye everyone.